Welcome back to another episode of the Coyote Car Channel. Today I'm going to show you a little trick that you can do with a solvent tank or one of those cheap Harbor Freight's parts washers. So stay tuned. So anytime you're ever working with chemicals, the two things that you definitely want to have are a set of safety glasses and rubber gloves. Now this is just for demonstration purposes, so I'm not going to be wearing my actual gloves that I wear. This is typically what I use. So basically what you're going to do is you're going to take your parts that you need washed. So I've got this set of parts here that are pretty dirty. And um, what you can do that a lot of people don't know is that this is kind of like a dishwasher. So the way it works is it's got a pump that's connected to this um, nozzle here. You turn that on and it sprays out the solvent that you have down below. And then you've got a tray kind of sitting up here. I know there's a lot of foam. But there's a tray that sits up here and then you've got a little section here. Um, and this tray can be moved forward and backwards like that. It also comes with this little sort of tub that you can use. And what I've found that works the best on little parts that are really grimy or have some decent amount of rust on them or anything like that is to turn it into, like I said, a dishwasher. So what you'll do is you'll submerge these down in here, just like that. And then you'll take your hose that's connected to your pump and you'll just point it down in there. And you just let it sit in there for a while and then you can move it around if you want, but essentially that's just working that solvent in through there. So then, when enough time has went by, an hour or however, you want to pull it out and then you've got suds just completely covering whatever it is you're trying to wash. And then I'm just going to do one. So then what you'll do is kind of take it out and scrub it like this. I found that if you put it under water and scrub it at the same time, that seems to work a little bit better. And just scrub it up real nice. Get your parts all clean. And that was a little tip I wanted to share with you guys, so there you go. So if you like this automotive tip and maybe you want to see some more, just uh, check in with me every week. I tend to put something new up. So thanks for tuning in, and if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe, like the video, and comment if you have any comments on it. Thank you.